Hey guys, open your chocolate frogs and other wizards in Swiss. What do I want to say? Of course, well, to begin with, uh, this is my first video on the new channel in English. Po -po -po -po. Da -da 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 -da. My name is Annie and I'm an illustrator. In general, I publish and illustrate books and draw comics. So. As for me, I like the silent comic format because uh, everyone understands it. Uh, you know, it uh, doesn't matter what language is your native language or what language you know, you will understand uh, the story from the pictures. In uh, this video, I want to tell you how I work on short comics, uh, short stories. In general, uh, this is a new format for me and uh, I came uh, to it because I want to show on Instagram not only illustrations, but also stories. The fact is uh, that big comics uh, can't be shown on Instagram, but small ones are possible. My first uh, short comic uh, was seven frames long. Mm, not really. Out of eight. Uh, you see it now? Uh, the eighth frame I added this <laughs> photo of my dog as a result. In uh, the comic I uh, talked about how I uh, choose a bed for a dog. Round or square, what to choose. By the way, tell how you choose. Spoiler! It turned out to be very difficult to draw short stories. How long? Do you think I drew this story? Let me remind you of uh, seven frames. A very long time, really, almost one month. This is unreal, but it is true. I drew the first uh, 16 pages comic in a month. You can see it uh, now. It is uh, also a silent comic, because I like this format. But uh, this experience uh, did not stop. Anyways, I will go on. On the contrary, I came up uh, with several new, more complex and interesting stories. Now I want to make videos about the process of working on them. And uh, this uh, will be the first video. The history of one god. Boo -boo. <laughs> Uh, so, I have uh, got an idea. I will be very happy if you suggest me your title for my story about the code. If I like uh, your version, I will thank you in uh, the new video. I think uh, this is a great idea. I will wait uh, for your options in the comments. Good luck! To begin with, I draw on uh, an iPad. Uh, I have an iPad Pro. This is amazing stuff. I love it. If you need uh, this information, maybe M1 chip, 12.9 uh, inch. The program I use is uh, called uh, Sketchbook Pro. Pro, yes. Uh, oh my gosh. <laughs> For some reason, it seems uh, to me that calling everything Pro is ridiculous, really. Sketchbook Pro, uh, MacBook Pro, iPad Pro, Pro 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 Pro. It's uh, really ridiculous. By the way, what do you think about it? So, my story about the code uh, consists uh, of two parts of uh, 10 frames each. Uh, to begin with, I want to tell about each frame and the general idea. Uh, the first part is uh, where the story begins and uh, in the second we see the final. In general, let's uh, start with the concept. So, how to find an idea for a comic? I will share my experience with you. So, I watched uh, the Korean drama K-drama Monster. By the way, I recommend you if you like this. Excellent detective. Really. I watched uh, the Korean drama and I liked the coat. One of the main characters had a light long coat. After that, I was already looking for the same coat online. But I couldn't choose one coat and finally both two. The story became the basis for my comic and uh, yes, the real story. But the fact is that telling the usual story is not interesting and it is not interesting for the viewer. So I changed it. I made the story more absurd, ridiculous and funny. By the way, sounds uh, like a magic spell. For some reason I remembered Professor Lupin. Ridiculous! 
explorabus ridiculous so maybe in this order these spells will work for more viewing to the video it would be nice really so the first frame i drew a character similar to the hero of the drama this pretty boy is uh, walking down the street in a chic long coat the second frame the viewer understands that this is a serious here i am sitting on the ottoman near to the dog by the way i didn't mention the dog how could i forget this important detail this is thor my doggy thor as the scandinavian god of thunder but in this life he is a french bulldog the third frame is split into two parts in the upper part i show the hero of the series and at the low slide yourself actually by this frame is try to trick the viewers expectations here it develops decorates and uh, complicates the story the first frame destroys the viewer's expectation because i liked not the guy but he's caught the fifth frame and I must say it was not uh, there before. I decided to combine two shots where I tie on cuts uh, into one and I edit an illustration where I'm choosing a code and I'm going to take the order. Frame 6. I'm choosing codes. I'm trying on uh, two different ones. So, next, um, frame 7. In general, this uh, frame is the most difficult for me, honestly. I have been looking for examples for a long time. I did not understand how to draw a sharp turn of the head in one direction or the other. Uh, the fact is that it is uh, fast motion. As for me, I understand how to realize uh, this in animation, but I don't understand how to draw something like this in a static picture. It's very hard, um, honestly. All the examples I found were creepy. This is true. In short, this is a very difficult task. I didn't realize that. You know, drawing the hand movement is not uh, that difficult and looks normal. But that's the head. It is difficult. Just a nightmare. Really, it was my personal nightmare. But then I found this. I knew I knew that dogs would save the world and I knew that the Disney company drew everything, everything um, and uh, it was at this point that my dog started snoring. I hope this doesn't happen on the recording. Finally, uh, then I saw this example. I realized that I just needed to add a few lines and to draw one neck. Uh, and uh, only parts from each of the heads. But it was really hard. Uh, this frame didn't come out right away. <laughs> to begin with, I drew myself to full height. Uh, but it didn't convey the idea of the choice. I wanted to, to show that I could not uh, make a choice for a long time. What to choose? The first or the second beige or light beige? Long? or longer honestly the choice literally broke me and it had to be drawn it should be noted that die to the fact that i draw comics without words there are more frames in a history and i'm sick of words and text honestly i don't know how i write books really i don't like working with text with all respect to books the fact is that uh, if I used all the words in uh, this frame, I would just write uh, this is uh, such a difficult choice uh, and uh, everything uh, would be clear to my mind, but it wouldn't have uh, looked uh, so cool. There wouldn't be this dynamic frame, the viewer wouldn't uh, have uh, that emotion. To my mind, it would be just words. Yes, understandable to everyone, but without emotion in the picture. So now uh, slide 7 is uh, the panels. The first I hold uh, two codes in different uh, hands. On the second slide I choose and I turn my head uh, many many times. And uh, on uh, the third uh, slide look 
at my eyes. My eyes will tell you about everything. Oof. On the whole, I'm very happy with uh, this decision. Now it is understandable to the viewer and uh, funny. To my mind, a very strong emotion came out and notice without words. Sorry, sorry, comics with words. Eek. So, next. Slide 8. Finally, I'm telling the salesperson at the checkout that I'm taking two cards. Slide 9. I'm paying and I'm picking up my purchase. Oof. <laughs> Uh, by the way, uh, this frame is complex uh, in uh, terms of the number of elements. There are a lot of uh, details and I'm drawing the girl of the seller. Uh, you know, I like her. To my mind, it uh, turned out very nice. Slide 10. Wow! Great progress! This is uh, the last slide in the first part uh, of my story and uh, it is very important. So, here I need to get the viewer interested. I have to show that it will be gone of the story. I thought uh, that the best thing would be to draw a coat on a clothes hanger. And I look happy next to him. Just look at uh, this face. It's very sweet. I like it. So, uh, where was I? Yes, of course, I talked uh, about the final frame of the first part. Oof. <laughs> and now I will tell you about the second part. So, there are also 10 slides here. To begin with, uh, in this part I need to show that I wear one coat even though I bought two. Uh, to tell the truth, it uh, was hard. I tried different options. I have been uh, thinking for a long time, but in the end I decided to show repeating slides. I just repeated two actions and uh, it took uh, six frames. To tell the truth, if uh, it was a comic with text, I could write something like uh, I wore this coat uh, all year rather than uh, draw six uh, frames uh, to my mind, but it wouldn't be as visually uh, powerful. I'm sure this story, my story, doesn't need text. Uh, you know, I don't remember who said uh, this uh, thought. Uh, maybe it was uh, in Bakuman. Uh, the phrase uh, was like uh, this. A good story uh, doesn't uh, require many words. It is understandable in action and illustrations. It uh, really works. Uh, I also think so. Uh, so the action looks the most understandable to the viewer. In short, uh, let this phrase uh, belong uh, to Eiji Nizuma. By the way, I am crazy about him. I think he could uh, say something like that. Has anyone watched uh, Buckman? Please, <laughs> please tell me yes. I uh, sincerely hope uh, that uh, at uh, least uh, one person will write that yes. Well. Uh, let's uh, stick uh, to the point. Uh, in general, I drew the same place in uh, three slides. This is a fragment uh, of the house and trees. And drew himself in a court in spring, winter and autumn. In uh, the next uh, three frames I showed uh, that I choose uh, the same court every time. As a result, frames 2, 4 and 6 it's me outside. The first, third and fifth I'm putting on or I'm taking off my coat. You know, I said put on and I'm sorry. I immediately recalled uh, how Sheldon gave Amy a tiara. And she's very happy, just going crazy, cool fragment. Seriously? You really think that another transparently manipulated? Oh, it's a tiara! <laughs> Actually, it uh, took me a long time to finish uh, the final. I wanted it to be very strong. There were many options, but in the end I settled uh, on uh, this one. So final! <laughs> oh my gosh! At frame 8 I'm hugging my coat. Look how cute it is. Uh, I wanted to show that I love it very much. What to draw in the uh, ninth frame was suggested to me by my boyfriend. Then we chatted with him about uh, my comic. 
honestly, I always seek uh, his advice, especially about the plot, as uh, he is very creative and can advise uh, a lot of things. Well, in general, a work turns out to be better than you discuss ideas with uh, other people. Frame 9, second to last. My hand slowly, very slowly, goes the sleeve of my coat. To my mind it is also very touching and human, as if it uh, were the hand of a man and not the sleeve of a coat. And uh, the last frame is my idea. By the way, uh, when I first came up uh, with uh, the story, I immediately saw this uh, ending. To sum up, uh, one coat is glowing among the rest. You know, I love things uh, like this, and I like uh, to bring uh, things uh, to life and uh, add uh, magic uh, to everyday life. I think uh, you have already understood uh, it uh, because of the numerous uh, references to Harry Potter. Now the final scene in uh, three frames. I really like it, uh, looks impressive and uh, very touching. Actually, if you think that uh, the most difficult part was to come up uh, with a plot, it is not. The hardest part for me is coloring. By the way, I even made a short about it. It can be found on my channel. In short, I tell that uh, it's been uh, two months, uh, I have uh, done a lot of things, but I still haven't finished uh, this comic. I have already mentioned uh, the Bakuman. So, in uh, this anime, two mangakas uh, drew format and formatted manga, and I draw a short, not short comic. In general, I find it a big lie that short comics look so simple. Because uh, of this, it uh, seems that uh, they can be done quickly. This is not true. The fact is that I have drawn 20 frames for two months and still haven't drawn my short, not short comic. Uh, that's it. I hope you enjoyed my video and uh, let me thank you for watching and uh, see you in uh, the next video. Good luck, uh, take care and have a nice day and a lot of unicorns. Bye guys! Ridiculous! <laughs>